hello in this video i would like to share with you about ecology ecology is the scientific study of the interactions between organisms and between organisms and their environment the environment includes abiotic and biotic components organism may compete with other organism for food for space for resources and two major processes that occurs in ecosystem are the flow of energy and also the cycling of nutrients these are the outlines for this video levels of ecological organization biogeochemical cycles energy flow population ecology carrying capacity and also quantitative ecology level of organization in ecology started with single individual single individual will form a population and then few population will form community and this community with a biotic in a biotic factor will form ecosystem and then we have biome and further is known as biosphere biotic versus abiotic components biotic is living things component in the ecosystem they are known as species meanwhile abiotic is non-living things such as temperature water ph soil wind and chemical in ecosystem of forest plants known as producers because plants do the important process in the nature known as photosynthesis in photosynthesis sunlight is converted to chemical energy known as glucose and then we have a consumer started with start with birds insects herbivores and small mammals and then we have tiger and puma as the secondary consumers and third tertiary consumers and we have also decomposers decomposers mostly microorganisms in the ecosystem also have abiotic factors like soils winds and water in the ecosystem of the pond the primary consumers small fish and the producers would be algae and then like in the forest we also have decomposers decomposers include bacteria abiotic factors involve light heat water and minerals nick and habitats a nick refer to a role of an organism and how it fits into habitat the adaptation of species to survive nick is the adaptation of species to survive ecological nick is defined as sum of usage of biotic and abiotic resources ecological nick depends on species uh, usually smaller species need smaller ecological nick compared to bigger species habitat 
an area where the, where the individual species live. There is normally microhabitat existed in large habitat. Microhabitat in the forest could be underneath the forest litter. Okay, we have a large habitat, the jungle for example, and then when you go to the jungle, on the forest floor, on the floor, we have litters made of debris or dead leaf, dead plants. Underneath the litters, we have microhabitat, usually for insects, uh, for worms, and for uh, ants. Biogeochemical cycles. Chemical and organic substances are passed from environment. The ecosystem is greatly influenced by the availability of nutrients and energy. Nutrients can be found in living tissue, for example, glucose in plant, or carbohydrates in plant, in solutions in the atmosphere and in the soil. Example of important biogeochemical cycles include carbon cycle, phosphorus cycle, and nitrogen cycle. Okay, uh, these are the, the aforementioned biogeochemical cycle. In carbon cycle, sunlight converted to uh, carbohydrates by the plants in the process known as photosynthesis. And then this uh, chemical energy or carbon uh, fixed by the consumer, especially by the herbivores, and then uh, it will